And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray. With me in the commentary box is Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Bournemouth up against Celtic. Well, Derek, with the final so close, really important for both sets of players to stay in the now. Block the final out of the mind. Stay in the semi-final and do your job. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. And here's how it looks for Bournemouth. Nathan Ake plays with Steve Cook in central defence. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Good-looking sequence. Throw-ins given. Here's the Celtics starting eleven. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Giving them the gift of possession. Extremely sloppy in possession. King. Harry Wilson. And Adam Smith on the ball. Pretty good reading of the game to win possession back. Callum McGregor, Scott Brown, McGregor, and it was a very good looking move but alas no end product, Steve Cook, Jefferson Lerma, Daniels, Ryan Fraser, and that's an important intervention, is it going to end up being productive for them? Can he give them the lead? Just found wanting in terms of the finish then. McGregor, Christie, a lovely first touch, that wasn't, it has to be, the goal seemed to be at his mercy, but defenders don't always have to touch the ball to have an influence. No, it's that pressure that comes from the defender that makes him hurry his shot, close. And Charlie Daniels has it, Jefferson Lerma. but they couldn't make it count. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, clattered away. Jefferson Lerma. Possession changes hands, the interception there. McGregor. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Callum Wilson. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Forrest. Now with Ryan Christie. I am. Christie. Here's McGregor. Now Lee Griffiths, Morgan, possession lost, intercepted, Smith, 
Wilson. Fraser. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. We've had the official word, and there will be a minimum of two added minutes. James Forrest now. Griffiths. They've given it away. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I must say, it's a real privilege to be here. Millions from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. I'm Derek Ray. My co-commentator is, as always, Lee Dixon. And with the atmosphere building up very nicely, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. This should be high-intensity stuff, Lee. Well, I'm so excited for the players. We see them coming out there. Excited because of what they've got ahead of them. Are they nervous? Looking at them closely in the eyes. Nerves play a big part in games like this, Derek. I'm nervous for them. Who's going to be the hero? Dukara. Freddy. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Cross lacking guile and accuracy. So here is the lineup. 
It looks pretty orthodox, Lee. Yeah, I love this formation, 4-4-2. The two main strikers will stay close together. The full-backs will link up with the wide players. The two holding midfields will sit in front of the centre-back. Opportunity it is! Oh, what's an opportunity! It's been squandered! Well, you dream of 1v1s as players. He's had one and he's squandered it big time. Oh, that's an interesting pass. He might be able to make it through. Will he? Top marks, finishing at his best, lovely through ball as well, the timing was perfect, excellent finish. 1-0 then. Mina Mina. Christensen. Yunuzovic. And Christensen has it. And that was a very fine read. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. He's got the right idea with that pass. So Bosloy. Others in the vicinity. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. into the center of the box not to be this time clattered away Onguene Mina Mina couldn't keep the ball this attack looks highly promising Yunuzovic, Onguene, and now Romalia. Ball with Yunuzovic. Wang Hee Chan. Lost possession. Hamilton. Gliding through the gears. Beautifully disguised ball. Oh, that's a goal at the wrong end. Well, it's every defender's nightmare. An own goal here. Well, let's see that again. I don't want to look at it as a former defender. I've scored a few of these in the time. And they were always my fault. Not playing for all of them. Important the players pick him up from here on in. So, an own goal. And now they are chasing this game. Read it superbly to take back possession. And threading it forward. It should be! A goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, that's like the other end, the striker putting it in the net. The goalkeeper has to keep it out, and what a brilliant way to do it. It's a short one. And played in. And completely misfired with that one. A long way off target. Yeah, but it goes in the top corner and your hero is worth an effort. A bit 
sloppy in possession. Shai Shue. An abundance of space. Nothing is indicated. Cross fired over. Oh, really and he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. And that is that for the first half in this Champions League final. And my goodness, Lee, did we think it would be so lopsided. Well, I didn't. And there's one team very happy in that dress room and the other one very, very... Ven 
no, 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 no. Well, this long wait is finally over. We have reached final day in this competition. Martin Tyler, along with Alan Smith, to give you the commentary. It should be a very...
Well, no doubt about it, the nerves have been jangling in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Ajax taking on Den Haag. Well, Derek, it's a cup final. I love cup finals. I've played in a few in my time. Very, very lucky to do so. Won a couple, lost a couple. You don't want to lose today, that's for sure. But you have to be brave. You have to take the game by the scruff of the neck. Looking forward to both these sets of players making this an absolute cracker. Well, here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending the lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll and he's broken free and the shot decidedly lacking accuracy well he had other options as well but he chose to shoot the bake Dusan Tadic well he has to be regarded always as a dangerous opponent but what should we expect to see from him in this game Lee well I love watching him he's got quick feet quick mind he wants you to come close to you so he can get past you so as defenders normally stand off him and then he's got more time to pick the pass he wants and he normally finds the best one Donny van der Beek Ball with Nicolas Tagliafico. He continues his run. Tadic. Alas, a wild, wild attempt. Well, after that effort, I'm not sure whether he's right or left footed. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Oh, this might pay dividends. David Neves, a fine block. Martinez. Mazraoui here. Ziyech. And moving the ball nicely. A really sumptuous ball. Can't miss, surely! Well, the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Can they get themselves in front here? Given away. Good vision, can he get onto this? And options in the centre. A decent effort, but the keeper read it all the way. Marin. Daily Blitz. On the bake. This with David Neres. He has plenty of support. Tadic. Terrific block there. Netsi. Couldn't keep the ball. Donny van der Beek. Delightful pass. Tadic. A really top-notch piece of defending. David Neres. Got to it easily, the keeper. When you look at those stats, Derek, it tells a story all of its own. They haven't created enough chances. The forwards have been off the game as well. They haven't really utilised the wide areas for me. But they should go on and win the game, to be honest. The bake. 
Flint couldn't keep it. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Immers. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. And so it is, the first half story has been written.